This model represents lactic acid fermentation. Before we begin the overall process, it is important to know the molecules and ions that participate. This is glucose, the purple uh, six carbon molecule, sugar molecule. This is pyruvate, three carbon molecule. This is water, two hydrogen atoms, and one oxygen atom. This is ATP, the blue sphere with three phosphate groups. This is NAD+. These are electrons. This is hydrogen ions. These are NADH. These are lactate. These are ADP. So a blue sphere with two phosphate groups. And these are phosphates. Now we're going to talk about glycolysis, the first step of lactic acid fermentation. Glycolysis is the process of breaking down glucose, a six carbon sugar, into two three carbon molecules called pyruvate. In order for this to occur, there are two phases. The first is energy investment, and the second is energy payoff. The energy investment stage begins when two ATP are used, and they each lose one phosphate group to become two ADP. Next, we're going to talk about the energy payment payoff phase. The next phase in glycolysis is called energy payoff. This phase is initiated when four ADP molecules are phosphorylated through substrate level phosphorylation, gaining four phosphate groups and ultimately forming four ATP. Next, two molecules of NAD+, four electrons and four hydrogen ions react so that NAD plus is oxidized, resulting in two NADH molecules accompanied by two hydrogen ions. This whole process yields two pyruvate molecules and two water molecules. Now we will explain fermentation, the process by which glycolysis may be continued. In fermentation, there are no oxygen or electron transport chains used. Fermentation expands glycolysis by regenerating the NAD+, and this regeneration happens when electrons are transferred from NADH to pyruvate, thus reducing the NADH to NAD+, and forming lactate. Two ATP are produced by substrate level phosphoryl phosphorylation in this step as well. The end. Thank you for watching. <laughs>